What's up guys, this is Tampa Tech and I'm gonna show you how to block private numbers and even groups of phone numbers. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing you wanna do is enter your phone contacts. Now you can select recent or your contacts. In your contacts, you click on right here on the upper right hand corner, the three dots, select settings. And then you can block numbers right here. You can block private calls. Just select that right there to turn it on. And you can block groups. Select your contacts right here. Select any of the following. So all these will be blocked. And then select done. So all these numbers will be blocked if they call you. Or you can select recent. Yeah, if you just got a recent spam call, you can just click on recent and then select their number and then hit done. And then that number will be blocked. Another cool feature that you may be interested in is, uh, let's go ahead and back, back into settings and do quick decline messages. And you can create your own quick um, decline message. You just click add. So that will be my quick reject response. And that also works on your Android Wear watches and even the Samsung watches. And another quick way to block numbers, if you just got called and uh, they hung up on you or you got a spam call recently, you select your phone contacts, select recent, the last call that called you, select that if it was the spam call, and select details, click on that I. Then you wanna select the three dots on the upper right hand corner, select block and hit block. Now, right here, this icon will come up and showing you that it is blocked. Uh, you can reverse that by clicking the menu button on the upper right hand corner and click on unblocked. And that would reverse it. Now, of course, there's other ways to block phone calls. Uh, this is the, probably the easiest way that block phone calls in your Android operating system. So if you have iPhone, of course, it's going to be different. And of course, there's apps that block phone calls, but they um, may have advertisements in those apps. So if you found this video informative, give me a big thumbs up. If you know anyone that this video will help, go ahead and click on the share button below and share this video to them, help someone out. And if you want more how-to videos like this coming your way, click on the subscribe link right here or down below. And if you wanna check out my other Google Android how-to videos, click on this playlist right here. Thanks guys for watching.